twice just keep on coming back all right i can't stop me was good i mean yeah. it was very very impressive the song might be in my top five favorite twice songs of all time the video definitely not anywhere near that but for me, the song was next level good. For you, what yeah, do you think I'd about agree. that? Yeah, I'd agree. The music video was a bit all over the place, yeah. but the song itself, it's been on repeat. Yeah. It's been on repeat since we first heard it. Non-stop. It feels like one of those songs that can be played at any time. <laughs> it's like, am I spitting on you? Do I just spit on you? <laughs> But twice do kill it every single time, non-stop is just a given. My guys, they're already back. It's not even been a week and they're like, so we've hit up the world, now we're going straight to Japan. Hey, Narendra the comic again. India. Well, she's saying she's called India. We've got a new nickname no, for her. No, we don't. It's Nonsensei. No, we don't. No, don't. Nonsensei over here, because we bring the nonsense every day, bringing the bakwas. She is Captain Bakwas, so we're gonna go with nonsense. Why, why, why I'm saying nonsense is because she's actually learning Japanese. She's learning Nipponese. So I said, you know what, this is a great name. It came out of nowhere, spur of the moment. I said, this is gonna stick now. You're gonna well, have to deal I with it. I think we'll have to see if it sticks, okay? <laughs> I think it's really, it's up to me whether it sticks no, it's and we'll not. find out. See, that's where people are wrong about nicknames. It's never their choice. That's where people are always wrong. <laughs> So that's why, guys, I'm appealing to you. <laughs> Don't let it stick. <laughs> but Twice do indeed have another comeback. This one's called Better Japanese MV. So like we said, they do always just put out the goods and they always do double up. Like when yeah. they have one comeback, they'll always do two MVs, sometimes even three. So it just came out yesterday. Oh, wow. And we are going to be hitting that up. Three million views so far. Always mm -hmm. wait the 24 hours, guys. Just what we do. I know with I Can't Stop Me, we were like seven days late. Yeah. That was for other reasons, but always and forever we will take that day gap at least so that the MV can get as many views as it can. But let's get to it. Let's go. There are no subs, because no on Japanese MVs, it seems like all across all companies, they don't do subs. Bit Halloween-y, just yeah, with the, the colour and colours. Yeah, orange and the black. Wow, okay. So this is a school setting, right? Yeah. You can help me with it. Dreaming. After the back, <laughs> Yes, 
Yeah. Wow. Wow, I'm loving this. This is very 2019-20. Yeah. Oh, okay, Donnie. <laughs> That's also a, a move it's and a half with that move, Mina move. But I love it. <laughs> wow, okay. I felt it. It was different. It was different. Not a normal track. It, it was mature in a way that reminded me of Breakthrough, but very different. It wasn't like their previous comeback in Japan with Fanfare. Yeah, no, not with totally fanfare. Totally different. Yeah, this it, it was... was playful but mature, whereas fanfare was just pure cutesy playful. Yeah, yeah. This one was there's something to it, and the way they made the beat here was a bit abstract. Yeah, but it did work. I really liked it. Yeah, it was like you expected the song to go one way, and they said, "Now nah, we'll just do something else." Yeah. And normally, I can predict that type of stuff yeah. when the song's going on. But it really did come out of nowhere where they just changed it up to this weird techno-y really, slash 80s vibe. Yeah, but it was really sick Like yeah. to listen to. You're expecting it to go one way and they just take a sharp left turn. But it was really, like, you can get into this song. Yeah, so I want to go down that dark, unknown road. Yeah. I don't know what's going to happen, but I liked it. Yeah. Yeah, I don't know. I don't know. I think the looks were served here yeah, as well. Yeah, On our really platter. Did. It mm -hmm. was a buffet they were giving us. And everyone stood out at their own moment. Everyone. I think, I think that Darkin probably got the least screen time. I think she did, but Darkin also got a little bit of a a little bit of a tease in there. You know, yeah. at the end of her rap, she did the shining light. She did, she did. Which is from Phil Special. Yeah. The end of her rap in Phil Special. So maybe this was produced around the same time as there, but they've waited a while. Or no, perhaps it's Phil more Special's just, quite a while ago I now. Mean, Phil Special was like a year ago. Yeah. But may, or maybe they just wanted to get yeah, a little bit of that back, in there. Have a bit of that. Plus, it's like a TikTok it. move as well, yeah, isn't it? Is. I think Sana, personally, Sana is the one who stood out here. Okay? I would disagree with you. Who who would you say? Chewy stood out. Uh, on this Chewy, one. Did. Chewy got some really Chewy's good been lines. Killing it. Chewy's been killing it for mm. like a year now, six months. But I think this time it really just reaffirmed Sana is like a leopard. I don't know <laughs> why. If there's like a big cat, Sana is. It's not a tiger. It's not a lion. She's like a leopard. Okay. She got the eyes. When she looks, it's like. I could come and eat you, but I'm not gonna. I see her as an ocelot. <sighs> it's a type of like big cat, but not a big cat, I think. All right, I'll put an image of it up here if somewhere. I, I mean, if I'm thinking of the right thing. All right, if not, there's nothing here. <laughs> uh, I'm not sure what this thing looks like, but if you say so. I don't know, harking back to those old National Geographic days, I might, I might have gotten the wrong animal entirely. If you're wrong, Dave, da Dave Damber is gonna be very oh. disappointed with you if you're wrong. I don't know what it is, so he's already disappointed in me. <laughs> but uh, no, really, really good song. I think it, it mm. sort of showed a weird range for them, mm. which was very different to Norm. It is a love song, but it's not in the typical love song way. It was yeah. more like, I miss you, I want to be around you, right. You're the per when I'm with you, I am better, I make okay. you better, you make me better, that sort of vibe, which is a more mature vibe of rather than, I just want to be with you. Yeah. You know, it has aged up a tiny bit, which yeah. I appreciate. I appreciate that. Nonsense here, bringing the knowledge, bringing the Japanese knowledge over here. See, I wouldn't have been aware of what that meant, but you just I was, educated. I was you picking just words. You educated me. I was me. picking words. <laughs> yeah? No, no, no. This is what Nonsense does. Whenever there's Japanese comeback for anyone, Nonsense going to be in the house telling me, educating, explaining things that I have no clue about. So, uh, Origato Kazamashita. You tell me, I said that wrong, or did I say that right? Let's just move straight on. <laughs> <laughs> but the MV was pretty good as well. It yeah. was fun. It was all over the place, but I always expect that with the Japanese MV. Yeah. But I think somehow it was less all over the place than I Can't Stop Me. Yeah, with. there was a through line here. They were in a school. <laughs> yeah. Like, I get that. And then they were dancing. Yeah. That's absolutely A-OK. -okay. Mm -hmm. That's fine. Mm -hmm. I Can't Stop Me was like canyons, train, in the middle of nowhere, 
sandy places. Yeah, dark room. To be fair, I think it might be one of their better Japanese tracks. Are you making a pun now with the name better? <laughs> <laughs> oh, I didn't even mean to. I didn't mean to, no. Uh, but I, I would say it's actually probably my favourite Japanese track they've put out. The choreo as well was actually pretty good. I think it, it was different enough and it was a bit eccentric where Mina was going like this yeah. and this. I think when I see choreos like that, I'm like, oh, it's probably JYP who's <laughs> actually like cr created them choreographed because yeah. he's got those weird mind bending bits where yeah. he's like we'll just take that to the next level uh it's what happens you've got experience you know that's not crazy enough let's just do something else yeah yeah jyp jyp yeah JYP. <laughs> <laughs> anyway guys if you did enjoy this video please like share comment and subscribe to the channel down there if you didn't if you didn't then you ain't gonna get better and no one doesn't want to get better everyone wants to improve yeah. everyone wants to strive forward to stride to better pastures but you ain't gonna do that if you don't subscribe you don't want that. You don't want that. So just subscribe anyway to avoid that. I've been the Ranger the Comic. I've been India. Nonsense over here has been here. And you've been great. And we'll see you next time. That's tomorrow. If you don't know, make a video every single day. I've been doing it every day for over two years now. We ain't stopping till we get to 10,000 subscribers. So do subscribe. Pop back again tomorrow for some more quality shitty content. So hashtag never not here. Never not here. Just how it goes. As I said, Bring in the Bukwas every day over two years. And if you don't know, Bukwas means nonsense in Punjabi. And we do indeed enjoy delivering that to you on a daily basis. So see you tomorrow. More Bukwas, more nonsense then. See you then. Skadoosh.